photos of D'Artagnan Whitehead are carefully placed. Candles lit one by one, positioned by family and friends, surrounded images of the young man. His life cut short. Whitehead was shot and killed in Saskatoon on July 11th. He's being remembered as a kind-hearted soul who was always willing to help another. Family and friends gathered to honor his life and his spirit. The man was a member of the Westside Outlaws street gang. His mother says he joined the gang for protection, but he didn't tell her why. She says he wanted to get out of the gang, but he couldn't. Whenever there's violence between gangs, experts say the potential for further violence is there. Whitehead's mother is calling for calm, saying the family has no interest in revenge. I can't speak for the gangs. I, for myself and for my family. Um, we love to have some uh, calmness in our lives. We don't, we don't want to uh, retaliate. We, we can't do anything to get him back. Why should we retaliate? That things won't change if we retaliate. Some of Whitehead's siblings spoke at the memorial, sharing stories about how much they loved him. His girlfriend of two years says her life will never be the same. Now that he's gone, my life just feels... It just feels like something's missing. And it's him. He's missing. He's gone. He's never coming back. And that's one thing I'll never, I'll never get used to for a long time. Whitehead's mother says the support is helping her deal with the loss. She encouraged young people to seek support as opposed to a gang membership if they're looking for help. The three accused are set to appear in court later this month. Morgan Majeski, CBC News, Saskatoon.